Hi, Zyra. How are you doing? I'm doing well. How are you? Doing great. Uh, what has it been like? Because the show's first, the first episode has been just took everybody by storm. What has it been like to be a part of the show? It's been so much fun, truly. And I don't say that to like give you crap or anything, but it has been really fun and really fun working with everybody and just a an truly amazing experience as a human being to 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 experience those emotions and to to have to understand another person like that. Yeah. And Izzy, your character in, in the show, is kind of torn, <laughs> literally, with your mother and brother down on, down in the down in the hole. You're still in civilization. Um, and you have to deal with a lot of emotion. What has it been like to portray her and really try and like get into the character? It's been a lot. It's been, it has been a lot. I'm not gonna lie. It's been a very um it, it was very emotional with yeah. filming. Um and I'm not I, I'm not the best at vulnerability, if we're being honest. Um, and I definitely had to work on that for Izzy because Izzy is a very vulnerable, she has that ability to be vulnerable with people, right? Um, specifically her dad. Um and it's you you really have to sit and ruminate in those feelings for a good long while and then just go out and do the scene and feel those emotions. Yeah. Yeah. Uh because this show reminded me a lot of a show that I used to watch when I was a kid a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> Except you get this perspective where you have people who are in another dimension and then you have people who are in real life. And that's the thing that really separated me. And I love about the show because you actually see what your characters are doing and what's going on while you're trying to save them. Uh, what has it been like, like you and the cast, how is it working with the cast? Cause you have a great cast with Nicholas Gonzalez and, mm -hmm. and everybody who's on there. It's just like, how has it been like working with them? Oh, it's absolutely fantastic. Everybody is super, super nice. I only, I only got to work with um, Nick a couple days but um, because everything is really, really separate, like filming days are really separate. Um, mm -hmm. But I, I worked a lot with Owen and Owen is absolutely fantastic. He is an amazing human being, an amazing actor. Um, he gives you so much to work with in a scene um, the entire day, which is really, those are long exhausting days. And even at the end of the day, he is still, you know, giving you everything to work with. Yeah. And you're dealing with a lot of special effects. So it must be, have you worked with this much special effects before? No, 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 no. This was, this was a first time thing. Um, it's, it's not as bad as you think it would be, mm -hmm. right? Like, I mean, if you have to look in a certain spot that can be a little sketchy. Mm -hmm. um, but a lot of times if it's, you know, chaos around you, you're really focused in on your scene partner. Mm -hmm. So it's it's not as bad as you think it would be. Yeah. Well, to me, it reminds me of playing with toys back in the day when you're a little kid and you're trying to like imagine things in different yeah. scenarios. So it feels like that would be the the case. But um, the show's just been on fire. I after that pilot episode, I've been watching every 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 show since because it got me hooked. I'm curious what's going on. Uh, what has it, what is your, have you heard the reaction? Have you been listening to the reactions? Because a lot of people are really enjoying it. Oh yeah, I, I, I really expected people to kind of, you know, come after me a little bit and be mean to me and nobody has, and it's been so lovely. Um, and everybody that I've talked to has really loved the show and um, it's, re it's, it, it's really nice that, to, to feel that um on something that you've worked so hard on that people do enjoy it it's a really good feeling yeah i don't know why anybody would be mad at you because i think your acting is great in the show i think your well, character you. I, I think your character really shows a lot into what's going on and really holds everybody together at least on the surface part of the show yeah yeah <laughs> everybody down below you're screwed you don't have it you're yeah you don't know what's gonna happen but at least on your area at least yeah. you hold everything together and uh the the relationship between you and your father on the show is just awesome especially with these images that he sees it's like it how how was it playing off of that and be able to like when you read the script and seeing oh wow there's like a real b world being built around this whole family so i made a choice very early on that i was not going to know i wasn't going to read any of the parts of down under right 
Mm-hmm. I only wanted the information that I got from Gavin because that's what Izzy would have. Um, and so I only had little snippets of things. So every whenever I watch the show, I'm learning new things along with everybody else. Um, but it, it, what I did know during filming, it was really fun. All the, the little snippets, I think, were just tasty little morsels. And that's and that's a hard thing. Like for me, I think I would want to read everything and see everything because oh, yeah. I'm curious. But yeah. I know it's in your part where you want to kind of segment it so that you can make sure you're staying into character. What do we see from Izzy for the rest of the season? Uh, her becoming her own person for sure. I think. I think, and what you've seen so far, you know, she's definitely, you know, she's her dad's girl, which that continues obviously. Mm-hmm but she does learn to become her own person and stand up for the things that she believes in. Um, yeah, yeah, I think that that's the biggest thing with Izzy. Awesome, awesome. And final question that I'd really have to ask is, what can you tell the Muse TV audience to jump on NBC to watch this every single week? Be- or if they miss it, go to Peacock because that's the beautiful thing about Peacock now. You could catch up on every episode and, and get Hulu. right back in track. Exactly. And Hulu. So there you go. So you keep track of everything that's going on. And in case you miss it, you're able to come back and actually watch it. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's fantastic. I love that. I love, I love that it's not just like if you don't see it the first time, it's gone forever, mm-hmm. right? You have another chance. Yeah, exactly. And this is a show you can't miss every week because you got to keep above. You got to know what's going on because it's yeah, not yeah, your loss. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, some shows you can like sneak in for a little bit mm-hmm. and you can, I mean, you can with this show too because Jack always says it's like a movie in every episode. Mm-hmm. Um, but I do think it's more fun if you know what's happened in the past because then you get all the little Easter eggs of like, oh, she did what? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Zyra, thank you so much for being a part of Muse TV. Really appreciate it. We enjoyed the show. We look forward to seeing it again this week and have a great rest of the day. We look forward to uh, talking to you again, hopefully in season two. (laughs) Fingers crossed, man. All right. Thank you so much for having me. Great. Thank you.